he comes in the training room and you know how he talks. My foot's fucking broken. Do you, you block a shot? He goes, no. Did you roll it? He goes, no, I, I don't know what I did. A couple of days come later. My, it's fucking broken. It's fucking broken. Like you, you got to do something about it. He can't get his foot in his skate. He's going to get a CT scan, gets an MRI, gets an x-ray. It's not, it's not broken, Jake. Like, I, don't, I don't know what to tell you. Like it's, it's not broken. You seem to think it is. This is a proof shows that it's not. Long story short, this goes on for a couple of weeks. They find out later he's got gout. This guy was a 27 year old professional athlete no. with gout. His diet consisted of Pilsner, red wine, Wagyu specifically. He didn't touch any, any other type of meat, <laughs> Wagyu and sushi. The amount of food this guy put down the night before, he put down enough for a table for four for himself. It, it is disgusting. Disgusting how much he ate. But then the next night, he'd go in and he'd be the best player on the ice. As much as the game has changed, he, has a, he is as old school as they come. He still has that old school mentality and he was a special human and, and a special player. Like he was, he was one of my favorite teammates. But the shit he did on a daily basis, you, you, couldn't, you could not believe. His pay tolerance must have been through the roof.